Hi everyone, it's Kezia over here from Kezia's Corner and welcome to my channel. My name is Kezia, as you guys know, and this is the place where I share all my love for makeup, beauty, and all that jazz. Today's video is going to be a makeup video because it's going to be a lip swatch video. Swatching, one second, we have the Long Stay Liquid Matte Lipsticks from Golden Rose. I just want to read a little bit about the liquid lipsticks before we go ahead and get started from the video, with the video, basically because I have the brochure here. Basically, they are a perfect, long-lasting, full coverage and non-transfer liquid matte lipstick that lasts for hours on the lips. It's weightless and without feeling of dryness. Enriched with vitamin E and avocado oil to leave your lips soft, supple and without sticky feeling. Easily coats your lips with its creamy, smooth texture and flexible applicator. Basically, you can check out their new lipstick shades from shade 38 to 46 and you can check them out either on Beauty Cosmos their website I'll leave everything linked down below or as a shop in Gura I would say thank you to Beauty Cosmos for giving me this opportunity to create such a video again of lipstick swatches I absolutely love lip swatch videos I love lipsticks they are my favorite like part of makeup as well part of my shadow if you want to see what the new lipstick shades look like what I thought of them and just how they looked then keep on watching and if you like today's video then give it a thumbs up and subscribe if you want to see more so yeah let's go ahead and get started with the lip swatch video okay so let's begin our lip swatch video I am so excited because I always love doing lip swatch videos and we have all the colors plus one on my desk right here i've placed them all after each other you're going to hear probably a lot of these noises where the lipsticks would fall on my vanity but it's fine i'm just so excited you guys know how much i love the golden rose long stay liquid matte lipsticks so i'm super 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 duper excited to basically try out the new shades we have about nine colors waiting for us basically so let's just jump right into the video this is the first one right here this one is number 38 as you know they don't come in shade names but they come in shade numbers so i'm going to apply the first shade oh my goodness this is the first shade so this is 38 right here. I absolutely love this shade. This is the perfect all year rounder shade for it basically. It's a perfect everyday lipstick shade, which I would have imagined myself wearing at work. Oh my goodness, I'm in love already. And as you can see, this is how they dry down. The consistency is perfect. Not drying at all. Oh my God, I always love and I'm so amazed with these lipsticks, honestly. Like, they have always been like my favorite liquid lipsticks. And I believe that this is like the first line of liquid lipsticks that I really truly enjoyed. Oof, number 38 already has blown my mind. So let's check out number 39. This is a bit rosier as well in, in the color. So, ooh, so excited. Oh, so pretty. And as you saw, I just used one swipe from the liquid lipstick. So, you know, the fact that it has like just took me one swipe to get this effect is absolutely amazing. So you need a little product and a little product goes a long way. Oh my goodness, this one is super duper beautiful as well. It's again, it's like a, like a rosy pink going into a little bit of a hint of I wouldn't say orange, I wouldn't dare say orange, but maybe coral, but just a little bit, you know, it's like a pink and coral shade. I don't know if I can maybe zoom you guys in a bit more. Yeah, I can just zoom you a bit more for the lip swatch video, but absolutely, I love this. Honestly, it's really, really, really beautiful. Oh my God. Mm -mm -mm. See, this is what I like about lipstick. You can just have mascara on, which is what I have on today, but this lipstick, honestly, it's so, so, so beautiful. Oh my goodness, so this is number 39. I think, actually, this is the first video, I think, a lip swatch video that I'm doing after braces. <laughs> Previous lip swatch videos, my, my teeth were like all over the place. Anyways, so this is shade number 40. This is a pinker shade, so I'm very excited. So as we go through the video, my lipstick applications kind of suffer, okay? So, just so you guys know. Okay, so this is the shade. Obviously, please ignore the application because the application is horrid for this one. But this is the shade. It's a beautiful, very natural, 
very beautiful pink. I feel like that this really resembles my lip color. You see my lips underneath have gotten a bit darker since I've been swatching lipstick. But it's, it's such a beautiful, beautiful color and a perfect for, it's perfect for every day. So if you're like looking for lovely pink everyday lipstick, I would really suggest this one, which is shade number 40. So this is shade 40. My makeup at the end of this always comes really bad. <laughs> All right, so we have normal looking lips. And now the next one is shade number 41, which is so pretty. I feel like I'm going to really adore this shade. So let's see. For it to dry, because it was, it is going to dry so beautifully, I can already tell. But this is shade number 41. And this is really pretty. I would imagine it like a date night liquid lipstick. I feel like it's so pretty. It has like hints of red, but then also hints of pink as well to it. It's like a very, very muted red, if you ask me. And it's just so pretty. And even like, what I'm, what I'm noticing is, again, what I already know, is that a liquid lipstick, any color can just, you know, set your makeup look. So even if you just have a bit of blush, a bit of highlight, a bit of mascara, which is what I have on me today, and a bit of foundation, obviously, you are good to go with a bit of lipstick. It just, it changes the game. And obviously now, you know, without COVID, um, well, there's still COVID, however, we don't wear masks as much. You know, you can flaunt your liquid lipstick again, so why not check out the Golden Rose new liquid lipstick shades? Oh my days, they're absolutely stunning. I mean, look at that. Look at that. Look how pretty it is. Oh, and now it's fully dried, fully so pretty. Mm, I love this one. Oh, I knew I would love this one. So this is shade number 41. Okay, so we have the next shade, which is shade 42. And I'm a bit excited for this one because like a nude pink, if I'm noticing from the bottle itself. So I'm so excited to try this out. So this is shade number 42. Again, I just had to use the applicator once. I dipped it once in the bottle, but oh my goodness, this is so pretty. This is so pretty. It's like, okay, it's like not a nude as I expected it to be. However, it's like darker, like a deeper one than the, the 39, I feel like. A deeper, it's like going into that red-orange shade, if you ask me. Oof, so pretty, so, so pretty. This is something I would definitely wear like in autumn, Christmas months, I feel. Although even in summer, it's so pretty nonetheless, honestly. And I just can't, like, can you appreciate how it just dries out so beautifully, so quickly, mm, without any hassle, so happy with this. My lips are starting to burn now. It's fine. The next shade is this one, which is shade 43, which really looks like a beautiful, beautiful pink nude shade, if you ask me. Smells so good. Mm. Okay, so this is shade number 43. Application not as good as always, but it's fine. This is a really, really pretty, like a very deep, deep, deep pink going on to brown like there's a hint of brown over here i'm seeing and i guess that's what i would have thought like the nude where it's coming from like nude in the bottle so pretty oh my goodness i just can't look at it all day like these are the shades that really just make my day they like help you cheer up they're very muted they're very everyday they're very like not so much out there you know like before they had like these like hot pink shades and like deep purple shades However, these are like very muted, very everyday, pink nudes, orange nudes. So these are the shades. So, but this like, this is really, really pretty. So this one is shade number 44 and I'm so excited to try this out because like it's, it's a brown, brown nude, I feel. Let's try this one out. I'm so excited to try this one because it looks so pretty. Yeah, this is definitely the darkest one. So this is shade number 44. This is definitely the darkest one of all the shades that we have tried so far. And it's just, again, a very beautiful brown nude color. Perfect for like autumn months, like when autumn hits, I will definitely be approaching this one. It's so pretty. Like I would imagine myself wearing this with like a winged eyeliner, some mascara, not much on the face, maybe some bronzer and some highlight and you're good to go. I absolutely love this one so much. I just want to say that they're also transfer proof. See? Nothing, nothing, nothing. So I wanted to add that in there as well. This one is shade number 45 and it feels like quite similar to previous ones. I mean, 
if you put them next to each other, they're not the same. However, they, they do have like the same, the same family type, I feel like. I feel like these two especially are quite similar. So this one is 43 and then this one's 45 and 45 is a bit pinkier than 43. 43 is more on like the peachier side if you know what I mean. This is 45 and I feel like I have so many of these shades in my collection which I absolutely love. That's why I have a lot of them. It's like a very deeper pink, darker pink going on to brown but like perfectly in the middle. I feel like these are such beautiful shades and I have so many of them from different brands. You can never go wrong with a lipstick like this, it just goes on with everything. Honestly, no matter what eyeshadow you can choose, this will probably like work, I feel like. So yeah, this is number shade 45, it's so beautiful as well. Mm. I like okay, so this is the final shade that we have, which is shade number 46. I'm very curious how this is going to look because it's quite similar again to the shades that we have swatched. I'm trying to choose which one is it is to the closest one, I guess. It's very, very similar to 45. However, 45 looks a bit darker. So I feel like that this is going to be a slightly pinkier shade. So that's what I'm thinking. So this is shade number 46. Again, it's like an everyday pink, but this is like very, very pink to the ones I've tried. Like I feel like the other ones I've tried were like more new muted, more nude browns, more like muted, I would say. This is like very rosy, pink, pink, if you know what I mean. It's like a very natural everyday. The one I had told you, which looks so similar to my lips, I think this is the one that it really resembles. I think this one, shade number 43, they really resemble each other, but again, this one is peachier and then this one is pinker. So this is shade number 46. Okay, so we are done from the lip swatch videos. However, like from the lip swatch video, however, I really do really love this new collection of shades from Golden Rose because they're very wearable. They're very everyday pink colors. Like honestly, like look at them. They're so pretty. Like look at them. So pink, so everyday, so Kezia's colors, honestly, I love them, honestly. The formula is brilliant, so pigmented, not drying at all, transfer proof as well as you saw. Dries down so quickly, so beautifully, no cracks in between, just so, so pretty. So I really do recommend you checking them out. I've always loved Golden Rose liquid lipsticks. I have previous videos of them if you want, I can link them down below, but yeah. Look for these new shades from shade 38 to shade 46 because they are absolutely Positively brilliant. I'm going to just zoom you out now because you don't need to see my face so close But yeah, I absolutely love these shades. They're so They're so pretty. Honestly, they're so pretty. I can recommend them. I'd like to remind you that you can check them out on Beauty Cosmos I'll link them down below either on the website or else at the shop as well Just say thank you to Beauty Cosmos for giving me this opportunity to test out these new liquid lipstick shades I hope you enjoyed this video. It was a lip swatch video if you like lip swatch videos and want to see Bye. Look ruined my momento. If you want to see more of lip swatch videos, maybe I can like do seasonal ones again because I that's what like I used to love doing them. I used to love showing you like my favorite seasonal lipsticks. So I love doing that. So if you want to see that, definitely comment down below. But yeah, that is today's video. I hope you enjoyed it. Tell me which was your favorite shade. I think my favorite shade, to be honest, was the one that we tried before the last. But I didn't want to be boring, so I will choose another one, which was this one. I loved 40 as well. It was like very beautiful, natural pink. <laughs> So happy with these shades, very me, very pink, very nude pink. Okay, anyways, I'm gonna end the video here or else I'll continue blabbing on. And I hope you enjoyed today's video. If you did, give it a thumbs up and if I see more, press subscribe. So yeah, I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye!